Hello, OSINT Africa. I do believe that you already know this tool, ABS IPDV. I mean, if you don't know, no worry. I mean, if you already work in SOC as SOC analyst, threat intelligence, threat hunter, incident response, forensic or other, you already know the tool. But if not, or you are just starting to work in security operation center, no worry. We're going to talk about that today. ABS IPDB, like you heard the name, ABS IPDB, it's a database that contains a, a bunch of thousands of IP addresses that are used to abuse different companies. Yes, or sometimes the threat actor can scan or use as a VPN or, uh, I mean, I mean, when they, they, they target the company, the IP is visible. So people collect those information and report in this tool. So, so this is really amazing because usually people from different organizations are sharing those IP addresses in IPv4 format or v6 format. So let's talk a bit about the tool. What I love, you know, you know when you click on uh, first you connect, yes, home, you have a lot of information, yes. If, if you want to report an IP address, or, 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 or for example, this is the, the API, if you want to use the API, for any reason, yes, this is like somehow some information about the tool. If I mean some IP that were reported, yes. Before we talk about the IP reported, yes, l let's talk about uh, this side here. Yeah. Report, report. This is usually if you want to report something, yes, individually, like single IP. If the IP, for example, that targeted your organization, you detect from your IPS firewall or or any other tool, yes, uh, it was compromising your DNS, your, 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 it was a DDoS or email spam. You can report here, yes? You just need to choose IP address, choose, and make a comment, you can report it, yes? But you can make a bulk report also. You, you have a bunch of IP addresses, you report all of them by following the recommendation here. I mean, you just need to take the time and read and you can also report more IP address, bulk report. This is the information about the pricing, the, 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 the free version, the price. I mean, it's really not expensive and other, yes? And, 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 and also what you can do, I mean, more information about the tool and, you know, other, other information. And, 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 and here, if you, I mean, the tool can be integrated, you know, in those uh, other, other provider, if you want to know that you can click on that, this is mostly the statistic about the, the tool in general, how many IPs are scanned, you know, in within one hour, that's amazing, 24 hours, million of IP, wow, that, that's crazy. So, so it's like the scanning the whole internet, yeah? And, and this is the contact, if you wanna contact them to maybe, I mean, I mean, I mean, use it, you know, has a, a, a main tool or one of the main tool or anything. Yes. And, and if you click on IP tool, you have a bunch of tool here. Yes. I will click some of them because they're still part of abuse IPDB. If you want, for example, to, I mean, I mean, I mean, uh, uh, get some information about an IP address. Yes. You click here, you get the information the standard format, the decimal value, the binary value. For example, if it's IPv4, let's take this IP, for example, yes? That's the, I think it's much easier, yes? You, you, you can convert, yeah? You, you get more information, yes? The binary, the, uh, the hexadecimal, the octal format, and so on, yes? And, 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 if you want to, you know, uh, make a ping, no, this is a subnet also, a subnet calculation. I mean, the, the tool is giving you everything. That's crazy, yes? Okay. Why I didn't get my subnet with this IP? Okay. Ah, okay, I, I think it will be only for uh, okay, okay, now I see. They, they, they want me to put with the mask, uh, let's say 24, yes? Yeah, okay. 
So they just get, uh, made the subnet calculation for me with all the information. Yes. So so the tool has many features. I mean, this is the information, you know, about the tool for the bulk check. Yes, you can read it and know how we can make the bulk check. Yes. And if you want to ping, yes, to, to, to get some information, if there is a ping request, you know, if there is a connection with any, you know, external IP address, for example, you can use it. Yes. Yeah. Then connect packet loss. Yes. Which means the connection is working yes it's not blocked by your firewall or anything yes and and dns lookup yes uh, let's write osint africa.net okay it's giving some information about my website yeah okay no cnm okay yeah let's encrypt uh, 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 MX, if, if I have MX, yeah, mail, OSINT, and a couple of information about, you know, the, uh, the, the website. So, so which means if you click here, you have a bunch of tools, you know, that can help you to do some troubleshooting, some investigation, yes? Then let's back to the main focus of the tool. Like I was checking the IP. If, for example, you you have SOC analysis or incident response. You 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 want to check an IP that targeting your organization like brute force or any other type of attack, and you find you saw this IP. You you type the IP here. Yes, home IP check. You get some information about yes. So you get okay was found in our database, which means it was reported. This IP was reported 18 times. Confidence of abuse is 78. That's really important for you. Where is it? It's, this is from Spain and, you know, it's from the internet, internet service provider. Maybe they're not taking care of those system. Maybe people can, maybe those, you know, are compromised and they use them as a botnet or as a VPN. It depends. Yes. So we, 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 we get those information. Yes. And the first it was reported, so it's quite new, you know. And and we get, you know, fail ban Apache Tripwire web attack, yes. Word WordPress, yes, brute force, brute force, yes. Show more, yes. So it was reported of abuse, you know, like of I mean brute forcing and different type of I mean web attack and bad web bot, yeah. Maybe those servers are compromised, the owner doesn't know, yes? So we get a lot of information. This is very important, yes? Because now we have analysts or incident response, threat hunter, threat, cyber threat intelligence analysts. We got an IP. We check, we find that it was reported by different third party, yes? And we get some information. We can even compare to what we have. So based on that, we can might guess that, okay, this IP we might not trust. Should we block or not? Or we should monitor because if you block, this is internet service provider. Maybe if you have people working in Spain, they cannot connect. Maybe you need to monitor it, yes? So it's up to you why you block, why you monitor, yes? So, I mean, this is the um, general idea of abuse IP. DB. I, I really love the tool. So, I mean, I hope you learn a lot of things. If you need anything, feel free to contact me or make the comment and I will be happy to get back to the comment. And don't forget to subscribe. It was OSINT Africa. See you next time.